I forgot which game I played where my controller would constantly disconnect. This thankfully is not one of them. Good work. I called from the mine. They... they said that they were incredibly grateful to the both of you. Now how about you give me a report of what happened? Depends so far. And okay. The game's a little boring, but... Okay then, this is what happened. Hell yeah. The saber shirt. Very nice. It looks like you did uh, you did much more than anyone was expecting from you. Doing of unexpected accidents is also part of our mission as bracers. I didn't know you're gonna be back. I hope to see more great things from you in the future. We'll just leave that to us. Well, you don't have to worry about Estelle missing anything since her nose is always in everything. So, so. Yeah, what he said. Hey, why are you saying that I'm super nosy like that? Because you are. Your skills lie being direct, nosy, and naive, right? Is that being a bit harsh, Joshua? Are you sure about that? But yes, the trails emotes are up and running, so you guys can use them if you want. Alright, that's enough, you two. Two of them. I drew them myself. M had nothing to do with it, probably. Okay, this is the last of the jobs you'll be doing for Cassius. You've heard of the liberal news, right? You'll be cooperating with them to get some coverage for a news story. Isn't that the name of the news magazine we bought the other day? What are the chances of that happening? When you say cooperating with them to get coverage, just exactly what does that entail? Aetherna's ass eating. Always a pleasure. It seems that they're looking for a skilled guy because they want to get some shots of a dangerous place. You need to ask reporters directly for the details. The reporter and camera woman from the news service are staying at the Hotel Roland. Here's a referral from the guild. Alright, how about we get over to the hotel and talk to these people? Good idea, let's go. Did I get another secret one? Ha! Can I kill this one? Lost kitten. Okay. Looking for my lost kitten. Okay, we'll find it for you, buddy. Aida. Are you Aida? What is she looking for? What am I ever to do? I hope those bracers will show up sometime soon. Did I hear your did I hear you say you're looking for a couple of bracers? Yes, that's right. Does this mean that you are they? It sure does. Even that handsome young man, too? That's right, myself included. I don't think we're supposed to do the RRR things. Well, well, what a pleasant surprise this is. There certainly seem to be a lot of people with the name Bracer these days. Does this mean that you are brother and sister or something like that? You know, it's gotta be it. When people have the same name, it usually means they're family. 
I guess that's kind of how it is for us. Still, I, I think this lady has no idea what bracers are. How did she go to the bracer guild and request a job then? I mean, I guess that could, that's feasible. She seems to have mistaken the word bracer for somebody's name. You can't be serious. May I ask what the two of you are whispering to each other about? It'll be a pain to explain all of this to her, so let's just go along with what she says. Why would it be a pain to explain? Just tell Bracer Guilds are. I'll try. You seem to be in trouble over something, ma'am. Glad I get to read these. My goodness, for such a cute little dumpling, you catch on quick. Young boys are so considerate. Hey, are you really distressed, or are you just trying to flirt with someone who's way too young for you? <laughs> That's right, I am. I am. I am so distressed. <laughs> My little arrow hasn't come home. I've never heard these people's voices. I curiously dozed off here at the cafe and she vanished. Who's arrow exactly? My little kitten. She's so snuggly wuggly. <laughs> I know if I might add, it's not just her face that's so cute, it's her personality as well. What's the color of your kitten's fur? <laughs> Let me think for a moment. Maybe it's like the color of the evening sun in autumn shining down upon a field of wheat. So it's tannish? <laughs> That's how I feel when I talk to artists. Migrating floundering salmon. It's pink. Color is pink. I think she's just out running around somewhere, so if you find her, please bring her back. Understood. We'll start by looking for outdoors. If we find her, we'll come back and report to you. I'll be waiting, I'll be waiting right here for you. Good luck, Mr. and Miss Bracer. Alright, let's go find the kitty. Your birds. If I was a cat, where would I be? You guys are children. Do you know where the kid... No, 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 no. Alright, let's go. I guess they're not there. Thank you for making me fight with camera angles. Oh. Look! But don't chase him, Estelle. Gosh, what is that cat? It looks like the one the lady was looking for. I'm sure that's the one. We better hurry and catch it. Where'd you go, you little bastard? I guess I'll just run loops. You go up. Oh, not there yet. I don't want to leave town, so we'll find him eventually. He's in the same spot. I know it.
Is this cat the ultimate hide and seek player? was a cat. Where would I go? Sorry. All right, well, he's having a little cat nap. All right, let's see if this bastard's somewhere. You guys hiding a cat? Wait, will you feed me? Some rumors that some fiends appeared in the mine. Or that my husband's alright. Yeah, I saved your husband. Now where's the cat? You. Alright, you're born. I don't think you probably went in there. Let's see you. Had his good friends with a girl named Uni. Always comes to see her off and pick her up from Sunday school. I'm a bit jealous that there are there a good relationship between parent and child. Oh, that's my library person. His wife had some. You old lady. It's rather unusual. Oh, I already talked to you before. All right, cat. I'm starting to lose my interest in finding you. Did you find her? We sure did, but she ran away. And so... It's quite peculiar since she's not afraid of strangers. Hey. I'll be waiting here, so please find her. Alright. I'm trying, lady. Climb this? Oh, I still have something on your mind? It's nothing really. How about you climb into the observation deck? Sure, I guess. Alright, I should be able to see you, little bastard, from up here. He ran this way. Not in the little alleys. You! Did you see the cat? Let me talk to... Okay, we talked to both of you. Is he in the sewer again? Would he be in the sewer? No, he wouldn't be in the sewers. Where's the kitten? You've got to be kitting me. So is this run around aimlessly? Look, it's that cat again. Get back here! <sighs> this is just like back at the Parzel farm. Seems like we're doing a lot of chasing these days. I just have to hit every area forever. Oh, did I just get him already? Perfect. There's that cat again. Estel, wait a minute. Maybe that kitten is trying to. Oh no, it's getting away. Went towards the chapel. Let's hurry and catch it. Here we go again. Mm -hmm, mm 
There's nowhere left to run, little kitty. It's time to be caught. Be a good kitty and surrender. Say right there like that and... Estelle, don't corner her like that. What do you do... To, uh, what do you intend to tell her owner if she takes a dive off the terrace? I, I know that, but it's not like there isn't any other way to catch her. Miro. That's right, this way. I'll join. I'm sorry the big bad has still scared you like that. Jerk. Come on, let's go back and see your owner. That's a good girl. Alright, let's go. Your owner's waiting for you. Oh, they actually put me there. Good. And that's pretty much everything that happened. Pretty sure Arl was on her way back to see you from the beginning. Each time we saw her, she had been walking towards the cafe. Oh, you mentioned it, and that does seem like what happened. There's a chance that because of us, she ended up coming back this late. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, don't be silly. But wait, there's more. You two brought her back safe and sound. I'm really grateful to the both of you. And especially you, Mr. Bracer. You were just the cat's meow. Uh, I'll take that as a compliment. You're blushing, Joshua. I'm sure I... I... <laughs> I'd sure like to put a collar on you. Then you'd be perfect. I want to go home. I apologize, but we're going to need to go back and report to the guild. He almost got quads. Have a nice day. See you later. I wish I could rig the duels and everything. Oh yes, I hope to be seeing a lot more of Mr. Bracer. Sop. Alright, we got the kitten. And then I gotta do... I have... What's I have to do next? I'll find the button. At least highway monster. Alright, where the hell's the highway? Down here. On the bridge on the second screen. Like, I'm pretty sure I know it. I've heard that voice actor before. And, uh... I don't think it was in a video game. Come on, Bob. It's fine, we're fine. Actually, do I have a lot of Septium now? Maybe I can open up more slots. I would like to go kill another Shining Palm. It's so weird that Circle is Cancel and Menu. So weird. Are you friendly? You are not. You are not friendly. It's not terrible. He's doing anything different. 
I can survive those ones. Just don't get crits and we're good. That's not what I wanted. She needed lucky things for something. I should farm those bad boys up. I do have a lot of CP. Now let me go see if I can sneak a uh, what's it called? A really quick shining palm. Because then I'll be able to do some fancy dancy orbment leveling. It's, I think it's a screen, right? The next one? Next one. Just testing to see if you guys remembered, and you failed. Right, where are you, Shannon Palm, buddy? They have a pretty good spawn rate. I mean, I'm gonna say that, and it's never gonna spawn now. But. Not as rare as I thought they would be. There you go. I can't get Sepeth, sadly. Did you get a crit one, though? Oh, he popped it. I wonder if 50. Uh, I don't know if it's better to do it at 200 or to give myself strength and. Eh, probably better this way. Killing two would be awesome. Sableye appeared. Yeah, that's a whole level and 40 to everything? Hell yeah. Alright, time to go. Other way. I don't like Sableyes. I specialize. My brand! Fine. Alright, let's dick around and get some ornaments. You! That's my little reporter girl. Dorothy. I don't think I couldn't add her onto my screen. It wouldn't have been nice. I wanted to. Estelle, always important. Yeah, sure, why not? Yashua. Can't really make any cool quartz yet, but it's okay. Uh, can we get any fun things? Oh, I still don't have action on her. I need to get action. If I remove that, it was Ariel. About you. Free attack. Get more magic or maybe a little text? I'll get fire. Hey, it's nice to have the fire spell just as a whole. I don't really make or break anything this early, but. Yes. What do I have on her? Cast? <laughs> One speed. Oh, ho, ho. what do we get? You gotta be kidding me. I think that's everything, right? We go to the bar. I think that's the dude. Can I rest here? No. <sighs> you! Oh man, I'm starving. <sighs> Did I not start the quest? <laughs> mm -mm. 
Wow, how cute is this? She's actually pretty useful. Where the hell is the hotel? Is there a hotel here? Where is she? Lodgings is blue. Oh. Why don't we skip out in the hotel? Ew. Right, I was wondering if I could ask you something. Is it true that the people from the magazine company are staying here? Well, you're certainly right about that. Did you have some business with them? Actually, we're here representing the guild to cooperate with them on getting the story. Really? Is that so? Then I regret to inform you that the both of them are out on at the moment. Oh, well, do you know where they went? Was the random sound effect no sound effect? Four chickens, you need to be loved, and I am your loved one, so I'm going to pick you up, and throw you down. The chicken song. Oh, well, do you know where they went? The reporter fellow said he uh, said something about heading over to the bar. We try asking there. The bar? Got it? Thanks. We appreciate your help. the bar in quotes. Huh? Huh? Who are you kids supposed to be? Are you perhaps the reporter from the liberal news? That's right, but how do you know that? I like getting the scoop on things, but I hate when people try and pry into my life. He sounds edgy. What business do you have with me? We're representing the Bracer Guild. We were told that you had requested an escort. Oh, so you finally come, have you? I've been waiting forever for you guys to show up. So, uh... Where's Cassius Bright? Uh, well, the thing is, he had another job come up. So he's not even in, Roland. What? I came all the way here so I could get a story on this famous racer. Crap, what a waste this trip turned out to be. I'm starving. I don't I don't get what you're so disappointed about, but there's no need to get your boxers in a bunch. We've got you covered. I guess I don't have much of a choice. You'll have to do. That sounds like my prom date. <laughs> Wait, what did you just say? Don't get your boxers in a bunch? No, the we've got you covered part. What do you mean by that? It's just like Joshua said, we're your representative bracers. Oh, and here's our referral. There's gotta be some kind of bad joke. Are you trying to tell me that you little brats are bracers? Brats? Is that how you're supposed to address a lady? What do you mean, lady? There's nothing sexy about you in that outfit. If you don't like my assessment, then how about slipping into a skirt and act like all the other girls your age? This clothing is specifically designed for those who wield a staff. And this looks like a skirt, too. Are you blind? You're such a rude old man. Oh, 
Who are you calling an old man? I'm still in my 20s, damn it. Back to business, sir. The fact is that we were dispatched by the guild. I'd be more than happy to introduce you to someone else, but I don't know when they'll be free. Welcome back, Em. I can't extend the deadline any longer. I guess I got no other alternative. Alright, rejoice, you kids. I'm gonna leave this up to you. What a generous old man you are. Easy as tell. I'm Joshua, and this here is Estelle. And you are? I'm Niall Burns, ace reporter for the Web World News. What? Though we won't be working long together, I hope you'll do a good job. <laughs> I'll be grateful when this is all over, too. By the way, where is it exactly that you want us to guide you to? Oh, no. The way I see it, you need a trusty guide because you're headed somewhere dangerous, right? Right, my destination is Ismala's Tower. I'm sure you've heard of it before. That's it? Your camera's off. Not only have we heard of it, but we were there on a job not too long ago. Well, this may just work out after all. So what, what I really want you to do is guide us to the tower roof. I want to get a picture for the magazine. Aren't you a thrill seeker? By us, do you mean that someone else is coming along too? Yeah, I've got my camera woman with me. I kind of fell for it, I'm a little bit. She said something about her orbital camera not working right, so she took off for the orbital factory. But she should have been back by now. If you're in a hurry, then wouldn't it be a good idea to head over there now? No doubt you're going to take off uh, to get your story once you meet with, a, with your partner, right? Yeah, that's true. Alright then, let's head straight to the tower once we pick up my partner from the Orbital Factory. I gotcha, I gotcha. That was good. Danger TGB things. Wait, anything but that. I'll do anything you ask, just please give me back my camera. It's worth more to me than my life. This is a problem. What should I do about this, Dad? Son. I'm facing away from you right now. I can't. You're the one who took the job, so you're the one who has to deal with it. Hmm? What's all the fuss about? Her nudes. Oh my bob, I know. It's definitely gonna be b hole pictures. Could this person be. That's her, alright. Hey Dorothy, how long are you going to keep me waiting? Niall, you came just at the right time. Please help me out here. What did you do this time? You didn't waste all your money, so now you don't have enough for repairs, did you? That's amazing. How did you guess? Are you like a clairvoyant or something? 
when you do the same thing that many times, even an idiot would know what's going on. Do you know this person? I'll join. I've been on a roll today, winning. I'm sorry to ask this, but can I get you to pay the repair costs? Fine. But I'll need you to write it off as a business expense. How much? Let's see. Abuse of emotes will get you in trouble. The decorative clock and the repairs together are 2,000 Mira. Hold on. I can understand the repairs, but what's the deal with the decorative clock? Well, I was looking around the store while he was doing the repairs and... <laughs> I saw a pretty clock, and when I picked it up, it broke. I'm glad we can write it off as a business expense. How wonderful was that? That kind of amount is not going to be covered. You got the one you wanted. Crap, it looks like I'm going to have to pay out on my pocket and get my money back later. Here's your 2,000 Mira. And this is your receipt. This is an unbelievably awkward combination if I've ever seen one. No doubt about that. Okay, there is an elf. I'm like, I see an elf dancing thing. But the fact that he'll pay out of his pocket for someone means he's probably pretty nice to work under. I don't know what to wear on this. Sorry to keep you kids wait. Uh, sorry to keep you waiting, kids. And take care of a little trouble. Who are these kids, Neil? They're the bracers who will be acting as our escorts and guides. If you're not using the commands, correct? Who would have guessed? They'll be taking the place of Cassius Bright, with whom we originally made arrangements. These young kids are... I'm Estelle, it's nice to meet you. And I'm Joshua. So it's Estelle and Joshua, is it? You may be young, but you seem reliable. I'm Dorothy Hyatt. I'm the new camera woman for the Liberal News. At the moment, I'm training under Neil. Why did I get stuck babysitting this blockhead of a girl? That damn editor-in-chief. Relax, relax. Something good will come out of all of this soon enough. You're one to talk. Never mind, just forget it. Now that we got everyone together, how about we go and get our story? Our destination is the Ismailis Tower, right? Alright, let's go. They just shout. It's fine. I'll sleep at the end. Actually, depending on how expensive it is. Maybe I won't sleep at the end. How much are you? I can... 40 bucks. Because you can run back to your home and sleep there as well. I am not made of... Where am I going? Malga Trail, I think. I don't think Neil does anything, but the girl will take pictures of the monsters, which is kind of cool. Right. Let's see. Do you actually fight? I guess we one-shot things now. That's fine, too. I do really wish I could see where the monsters were. I 
I could speed run these bastards. Okay, it is this way. Oh, M's on her roll. Trying to stay in the top five. That was just like treasure chest outside. Oh, this tower is really tall. What are we floors it has? The last time we were here, we only made it as far as the second floor. But judging from the scale, I'd say it probably is about five or six. There should be five, at least that's what it is said in a book at home. It was investigated some time ago, but it looks like it was abandoned after that. That reminds me, it seems like there are a number of other towers like this in Ubro. That's correct. There are towers similar to this in, uh, well, excuse me. There are towers similar to this one in the Bos. Ron and Zeus regions. They all seem to be built around the time that the liberal kingdom was founded. Is that so? I think I'm starting to get a feel for history already. <laughs> My job this time is to uncover the truth about them. Dorothy, get a few long angle shots of this place. Here we go. Amazing. Is a, is a photographer's personality supposed to change by taking a camera in their hands like that? M, do you get all hyped up when you grab a paintbrush? Is that what this is? Is this an artist thing? She certainly looks like a pro. This happens every time you try to take a picture like that. But trying to act professional, just sh get me a shot using your usual style. I guess I shouldn't try to tone down my style just to look good. Well, I guess I'll have to do it in my own way. Oh, looking good, looking good. Now that's what I call a, that's what I call sexy and cute. Here, here we go, say cheese. I don't get it. Why is she doing that when she's not taking photos of a person? Somehow it seems natural for her. She says she can see the expression of the scenery, whatever that's supposed to mean. You wouldn't understand, you're not an artist. And believe it or not, she takes some pretty breathtaking pictures acting all ridiculous like that. I guess it could be considered a type of genius. The kind that's borderline insane, though. Wow, people are sure never what they seem to be. Okay, I'm all done here. Alright then, let's get inside. We're headed for the roof. I'm counting on you two greenhorns. You just leave it to us. We won't let any monsters lay a single paw on you. Please make sure to keep close behind us. I have leftover pork chops. I'm gonna eat those. Right, where are we going? Are there monsters here yet? Or do I have to wait? Found one. 
can't harm us, but dangerous in groups. Aw. They came out, but equal friendly energy. I mean, that's basically it. Why not? Stronger than I should be. Maybe I am. I want to find treasure chests. Buddies? But I have no CP. Oh, I, uh. What's it called? I killed the Shining Pump. You grind up fine, or why are you. No. Honestly, the game is just normally pretty easy unless you're doing something really wrong or fighting something ahead of time. I mean, it's the beginning of the game, so can't expect too much out of it. There we go. You already got the treasure. Don't be greedy. I like you can talk to all the treasure chests. It is an achievement, although I missed the first one already, so it doesn't matter. All right, we got tear bomb and knitted shoes. Mind your business. If I were shoes, where would I be? I don't want to go there yet. You are? Ooh, actually, oh, I don't have enough. That one hurts. Oh, we had the strength boost. Okay, you guys can't die. Please. Yeah, fight her. That's fine. Little shell buddies don't seem to move much, so... I'll get you eventually. Yeah. Had to go and say something about one shot and things, huh? Oh. It just mocks you if it's emptiness. How dare you. Right, how the hell do I get up there? I don't know if these are monster chests. They might be a monster chest when they're that color. Or does it just mean there's gear? I don't know. My luck they're gonna gangbang the NPCs though. Okay, just regular. But maybe they have to be more red? He's got too much movement as it is. Shaking trance. 51 a month? Sure. You have access to the awesome trails emotes now that I'm specifically cranked out for this game. There is no trance to the man. Come on, get with it. It's all about the tits. There you go. 
go. Give us one. For me. Actually, I'm not sure which way I'm going. Alright, that's probably doubling back. Nice. Did someone get a race car? I did not see it. Oh, it's a good one. Not quite the goodest one, but still pretty good. Thanks for letting me know. Sneak behind you. Alright, see, I told you someone would like that. You guys, these ones explode. Maybe you get hit with a bunch of magic. I don't know if you can one shot them, so we'll, we'll go. Can I hit more than one? Yes. I don't think they move, but maybe they do. Nah, they just spam arcs. Okay. My, my luck they'll end up two tapping them. experience. Three. Thank you, game. Tin staff. What do we get? Three more attack. Sounds good enough. Yeah, Dorothy's helpful. The other dude. I wish he was at least tanky or something cool. For them? Okay, there's gotta go another up or another route from the other four. No big deal. I don't know if monsters respawn. They look like they do. Down to go up? Hmm. It's possible. Like he just smokes. He doesn't really help. It's fine. like a wrong floor though. Fine, we're fine. I know, I wish he would do that. so slow in this game, initially. Actually, I don't know if it ever gets better in this one. Please don't keep hitting her. Uh... Alright, I think I just missed something on this floor. Alright, now we're heading... No, no, no! Oh, come on! Why'd you move this time? I'm 
shit. Yeah, Dorothy's a monster. I keep her on my team. This one is east. Now, is this the right one or the wrong one? Actually, this looks like it's the correct way. Potluck in a shell. But ask yourself how long that potluck has been in this chest and if you feel lucky. Alright. Here's the food one. What does it do? Oh, and it cures you. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Oh, that's actually a big fight. Hmm. I don't think they're that dangerous. I'm just gonna conserve everything. Then you bastards out. You eat the... Bastards. They eat the CP. Uh, I can't get over there. Slowly but surely, he's going to die. Don't call me Shirley. What do you have, one Mother truckers. How many times I've got them to, like, one? Sure there's gonna be a boss up here, probably. One more SM. Oh, it's bright out here. It looks like we finally made it to the rooftop. Would you look at the beautiful scenery? Now this is something else. It looks like we'll be able to get a better shot than I had originally anticipated. And that's the thing I was telling you about earlier. If you're one. I wanted to win more. I wonder what that's supposed to be exactly. It looks like a giant ornament operated cauldron, if you ask me. According to my sources, it's some sort of ancient device. Although no one seems to know what exactly it's used for. Hmm. Joshua, did you know something like this was up here? It's no use hiding. I think it would be wise to come out where we can see you. <laughs> Please don't hurt me. I'll come out already. I'm coming out right now. <laughs> Who is this guy? So somebody arrived before we did, huh? What a surprise that was. Nice find, Joshua. And you are... I apologize. Please forgive me. I'll give you... I'll give you every last mirror I have. Please spare my life. Look here, buddy. Please don't mistake us for robbers or something weird. You do recognize this emblem, don't you? Estella showed the man her guild emblem. Wait, isn't that the Bracers Guild? So you're trying to tell me that you're Bracers? In the flesh. 
I'm Mistel, and this is Joshua. And we're here as reporters on the Liberal News. We're having these two provide us escorts so we can get coverage on the tower. I'm relieved to hear that. Please don't, uh, please just don't ever scare me like that again. That's close to something. The fact that you came up here like that made me suspicious of all y'all. This dude looks like you're nerd. What are you talking about? I trust him. He's got the cool glasses. Maybe he'll join our party. Look who's talking. You seem like quite the suspicious fellow yourself. Do you mind telling us who you are exactly? I apologize for my belated introduction. My name is Alba, and I'm an archaeologist. You think he's the You just think he's the bad guy because his eyes are closed. Was Brock the bad guy in Pokemon? I actually haven't seen any of the later seasons. He could have been. I came to investigate the tower in order to further my research of ancient civilizations. All alone? I'm surprised you made it here in one piece. Uh, somewhat, but actually, I've grown accustomed to investigating runes like this. You see, I've got a lot of confidence in my ability to flee from monsters if need be. Although this time I found myself in a bit of a pickle. You are one crazy scholar, if you ask me. However, being an archaeologist would mean that you're familiar with the tower's origins, right? Well, more than the average person, anyway. But since I've only just begun my investigation, there still are a lot of things I don't know myself. That's fine, but is there anything interesting you could tell us about this place? I think you missed it too, Trance. I had the whole Josette mayor thing I forgot all about. It'll be used for an article. Let's see. Has everyone heard of Septarians before? Probably won't have to listen to that ever again. I think Father Divine maybe said something about that before. Not yet. I, I, I remember the sneaky stuff. It's the time before. Like, I don't know why I just blanked it. Probably because it was like 500 hours of game stuff back, you know? You mean the seven treasures endowed with power and bestowed upon the ancients by Adios, right? That's exactly what I'm referring to. It seems these ancients ruled the earth, seas, and skies using the powers of these treasures. It has also been written that they were even able to unlock the secrets of time and life. Approximately 1200 years ago, when this ancient civilization was destroyed by a mysterious calamity, these Septarians were also lost. That is the legend also recorded in the scriptures of the Septian Church. But what does that have to do with this tower? A part of the legend states that one of these Septarians slumbers somewhere within the brawl. Its name, the Oriol. 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 I'm not going to say these right. The Oriol. The word certainly has a strange ring to it. I saw his eyes, by the way. He's smiling too much. Maybe he is the bad guy. If the legend is really true, I figured I might be able to find some clues here at the tower. Since it's one of the oldest runes in all liberals. So I came out to investigate. 
Oh, what an inspiring story. It is, isn't it? You can feel my passion for things of antiquity, right? This is splendid. I'm overjoyed that there is someone else who understands the way I feel. So, did you find any of those coups you're looking for? I, I'm still working on that part. But if, it, but if I can figure out how this device works, I might be onto something. I think it's an interesting story, but as it stands, it's a speculative one. From what you've told me, I'm sorry to say it wouldn't fly as an article. I see. That's extremely disappointing to hear. I'm surprised myself. Contrary to my expectations, you are serious about the articles you write. That's because I can't write articles based on certain news sources. We may run the occasional gossip column, but it's the policy of the liberal news to verify our information. That aside, let's get what we came for, shall we? And yeah, we got shit to do. Dorothy, I want you to get several panorama shots of the Roman region. Everything else, I'll leave up to your aesthetic touch. Now get out there and get me some good pictures. Understood. Your apprentice, Dorothy Hyatt, is ready for action. Nito Reno appeared. Yeah, as for you, Mr. Archaeologist, how about heading back to town with us when you're done here? These two kids may look like a couple of rats, but they do a pretty fine job as escorts. Something about the way you said that makes me feel like it wasn't a compliment. I can't wait to get Tita. If it's alright with you to have me along, then that's far more than I could ask for. Then I guess it's decided. So how about we take a break until Dorothy finishes getting her shots? Oh, the view is great from here. From this height, I can see all of Roland's. With scenery this good, if someone turned this place into a tourist spot, they'd probably make a boatload of Mira. Yeah, you're probably right about that. What about all the monsters, buddy? What's wrong? You look a little pale. <laughs> I can't hide anything from you, can I? After we stepped onto the roof, I just started feeling a little woozy. Are you going to be okay? Yeah, I think I'll be alright once I get a bit of fresh air. Why don't you make the best of this opportunity and have a look around yourself? But broadening one's knowledge during a time like this is all a part of being a bracer. If you come across anything of interest, then you can tell me about it later, alright? Sometimes you can be such a smooth talker, you know that? Alright, I'll have a look around. Maybe he's afraid of heights. But if you start feeling any worse, you let me know, okay? Sure. Oh shit, I can save it. Whoever said this game was wordy. Alright. <laughs>